Hi, it's Melanie. It's stacking up. Time to do that dirty laundry. Today we're looking at Summer Circle, and we're looking at who's not talking. This is Summer's Inner Circle. Everyone in this circle has given an interview except the boys because they're minors, and Grandis because she's out of town. I wonder if uh, she'd consider sitting down with the interview room and doing an interview because uh, that would clear the air and get some of this dirty laundry out of the way. So what do we know about a rib doctor? This is the back door to the basement, and this is the way Summer would have had to come out of the house. In the background, you'll see Grandma's trailer where Mom was over there helping her with her knee brace. They knew exactly when Candace would be distracted. They knew when to make their move. They know what direction to go in to keep from running into someone. Someone knew when to strike. The intruder would also need to have a safe place to hide all day where the dogs wouldn't alert. The abductor would need a heads up when they were coming home so they could get into place and not be seen. This was almost certainly an inside job. It's just a matter of eliminating the wrong suspects and getting down to the right. A good thing to remember, the closer the abductor is to the child, the more likely the summer could still be alive and safe. Was someone in the inner circle so desperate to protect Summer that they rescued her? Somebody is dirty, and we're going to figure it out. I'd like to say thank you. I have over 50 subscribers now in almost one week, and very happy to say that the most of the responses have been quite positive. Uh, like and subscribe, and keep in touch. Stay in the loop, and uh, I'll see what I can find for you soon. Thanks. Bye.